Hi travelers, Salili Voyageur, Cido Nomad here. So today we're in Izmir, still in Turkey. And so I'm not staying very long in that city, so that's why it's gonna be a little bit special today. There's a competition, like regional competition in the city. And so they asked me just to do the, um, the warm up for the kids. And uh, they've been offering me to stay here like two, three days to discover a little bit judo in the city. So I've been working two Thursdays and uh, tomorrow I will enjoy a little bit to see how it is. So yeah, now training and then we'll meet probably in Antalya and I have a surprise there. Maybe, so we'll see. Okay. So, I know you don't speak English, but going to make the translation. Hi guys, Judo Nomad here for the weekly Judo travel video. So we're now in uh, Antalya. I couldn't film in Izmir. I had too much work to do there and I didn't stay long enough. So I'm in Antalya with uh, some of the old friends and some of the people that I've just met yesterday. We're now uh, going to the runes, which is uh, like 30 kilometers away from the, the city. And I will let, let the guide explain uh what is it here and what we have to do for the rest of the day bless ya so here is nothing for you g'day joy and fans how you doing today we're having a hike through the termosos ruins which is from 333 bc it's one of the most perfectly preserved ruins in turkey currently so it's a pretty easy hike up not too challenging so uh after we all met last night we decided to rent a car and come up to the ruins uh, it hosted Alexander the Great um, back when he first conquered it and then when his best mate claimed it after he died he got stabbed here so it's been empty ever since but we're here to reclaim it under a joint flag of France, Australia, Iraq and Scotland so uh, Scotland is a country? Uh, ask, ask me in 20 years that's, a, that's Join's official stance on, on his channel we're pro Scotland all right, so I don't know if there's any other fun that's, facts. That's very good. I think that's it. So we're gonna sign <laughs> Thank off for you, now. Nathan, the guide. You're welcome. So now we will go and show you a little bit how it looks like. Give you a proper view. Yeah, and next we're going to the beach, right? Yeah, me okay. and buddy. Ah, there's another runes, and then you will be able to see the beach body of Solon. Okay, so we're going to the second room, so I don't know where it yeah, is. I got directions, buddy. And I got yeah, you. maybe you will have nothing commenting again because he's good at it, better than me, more funny. All right, let's go. <laughs> Something to say? Oh, Kanichi Wagwan. <laughs> G'day, we just saw the ruins and they were pretty impressive. A few of us almost died, but <laughs> as you can see, we survived. Yeah. Yeah. Die from the hit. Okay. 
All right, second party of the day. So it's not Nathan anymore. He's like sick of the shit. I'm here. I can talk. <laughs> you can talk. So I like, I like, I, it. I, like it feels. I will say the first part, and you will like complete the the thing. We'll work together. Yeah. So we're in the ancient ancient theater of uh, Aspendos. I don't have the same good accent as him. Sorry for that. And so it's the most well-preserved uh, theater in the world. I remind you that I was in Plovdiv in Bulgaria a few months ago, and you can see one of the most good preserved also there that is beautiful. It's like 2,000 years old. Yeah, built in the time of Marcus Aurelius. So, yeah. Built in the time of Marcus Aurelius. And do you have anything else to say before we go for the filming? You can see that beautiful blue sky that's right above us. But um, when it was first here, they had a big wooden roof. Yeah. So like that was covering it. So you can imagine how hard that would have been to, yeah. to build. Yeah. But it's amazing. They would have had um, the big theater boxes for um, the royal members up there as well. So like emperors and stuff would have been up in those boxes up there. But the acoustics are amazing. <laughs> like you can really hear like the echo. The echo <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, yeah, we will promise not to show any swear words, otherwise we might get kicked out. Yeah. yeah, and you know, I want to fly my drone so bad here, but there's a big sign writing, don't do that. So, we'll see. Maybe I will film a little bit and in the last minute I will take the yeah. drone, but we'll see. Okay, so guys, now I'll let you see, and if we have time, we'll go to the waterfall. Otherwise, I see you tomorrow for something else. Do you say cheers, actually, because I, I always say cheers when I finish my video, but ah, right. does that make sense to yeah. say that? Well, cheers means thank you, so I... Uh, yeah. yeah, cheers. So you probably say cheers and goodbye. All right, yeah. good day, mate. What do you say? <laughs> good day, mate. Good day, mate. Trying to learn the Australian language. Okay, so let's see for the next I will film around. Okay, so we couldn't make it to the waterfall. Instead, we might go tomorrow morning. So we just went directly to the um, to the beach. That's the first time I got to swim in the beach. This project, so I'm really happy. Solen is just right here. She's shy with the camera now. Okay, and the other ones are just uh, the I cannot speak English. The other one are just behind there. So I'm gonna fly the drone a little bit. Party coming tonight and tomorrow. I reserve you something that might be very good. See ya. So second day in Antalya traveling. Today we are in the waterfall. I think the name is Selal waterfall, but I, I will make sure. And yeah, after that we're going to another place. Maybe Nathan will explain better than me because you know everything here. So let's see. I think it's going to be very cool because it's so fucking hot here. It's like 35 degree, so it will will appreciate. It. I don't know if there is something special to say about those waterfalls. Something for sure is that it's really beautiful. And so Nathan is not here to say, so I might just film and in the post, um, in the edit, I will just like say what is important to see about here. So yeah. That's it for the waterfall. I don't know if you can see how much I'm sweating. But basically I've been filming with the drone and the guys just left like walking a little bit i thought they would just wait somewhere but somehow i lost them it's been almost one hour that i'm walking looking for them so yeah i really don't know where they are I'm sweating so much so i'm going to sit somewhere have a drink not a beer because i'm driving they gave me the key and yeah i hope they're okay it's a little bit worried because we have internet and 
I text but no answer. So we'll see. been driving 300 kilometers like very long it was good condition for something like two hours and then it became really bad and we have only 20 minutes to be there so we are in a, I think it's called Kake it's a salty bath and we'll try to have something otherwise we'll just put some generic video of it all right we're back with uh, Nathan the storyteller <laughs> Solen Airy just there so it's fucking rainy, as you know, and it's very beautiful. The quality of oh, your phone nice. is very nice. <laughs> so some cuddling, and yeah, just enjoying the time. Pamukkale means cotton castle in Turkish. This area is famous for carbonate mineral left by the flowing of thermal spring water, and so it's located in the Aegean region. So I let you see the image that I ordered from it. 